What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, welcome, new subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, Capture Sag, everybody in between, up to the basics. Time is fluid, energy is fluid. If it doesn't, uh, doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. I do. Okay, so I received another channeling. I'll probably um, um, uh, do some more sign readings today, just to let everybody know. Um, I probably will. Um, I did Capricorn earlier. For week two of October, I'll probably do uh, whatever sign I feel guided to do um, and then just go from there. I do have some personal readings tonight, so um, in between those. And personal readings are currently open. Uh, there are still some slots available. Uh, if you're interested, you have to text a book. And I'm still do, I'm, I'll, I opened up a new service. Um, um, uh, if you are interested, I did a video on it today kind of explaining a little bit of it, uh, life coach, um, if anybody's interested, okay? All right, so here we go. All right, so the channel message I received was, um, someone knows inf huge information I heard, huge information on, um, a, I heard a ruse, specifically a ruse, like R-U-S-E, so like a facade, a fraud, a con, um, in the past, a hidden camera in somebody's home in the past, and they portrayed it to be a reality show. Um, but they have they know information on a person through the hidden camera that um, pretended uh, to be married to somebody, and they put somebody in a fraudulent marriage. But they did it strictly to take their money. They know information on this person and the situation. Her, um, it's at least two people in the universe. It could be you or somebody you're connected to. Heard one of these people is about to um, um, about to give this information to a private investigator soon. Um, that's been investigating this situation. One, they're about to go to the police and release this information. So you plug it in how it resonates. So it's it sounds like it's two people in the universe it may be you or somebody you're connected to only you know if you fall into this situation and story not anybody else you have to plug in how it resonates but it sounds like they they viewed through the voyeur camera in the past but they were not told it was a voyeur camera it was a fraud a con a scam basically um but they viewed through it thinking it was a reality tv show but in reality it wasn't it was um the family or the person did not know uh, the damn voyeur camera was even in, even in their house. And on the back end, a person or a group was making money off them. It was a group. It was a group is what I just heard. It was a group. So it was a group that was making money off them on the back end, silently, secretly. Um, and the person or the family, it was a family. And it was a family. It was a family. They were um, viewing. For a reality TV show. But they were told it was a reality TV show. By a person or people or this group. But in reality it wasn't. It was a hidden camera. And the family didn't get anything from it. Somebody that also viewed through the uh, illegal voyeur camera. With these people. Basically went through the camera. And was pretending like they were proposing or what have you what have you to the person through in the actual entrapment situation but people didn't know it was an entrapment situation they were told it was a reality tv show they another person came through the camera is masculine energy air sign a masculine energy air sign so a masculine energy air sign Gemini Libra Aquarius came through the voyeur camera <laughs> and proposed and to propose to i guess the head of household or what i'm assuming it was a single person in the reality tv show or they 
people thought it was a reality TV show, but it wasn't. It was actually an abusive entrapment situation and proposed to this situation, uh, to this person. But the people voyeuring through the camera, these people didn't realize it was an entrapment situation, a scam, a spam, a fraud. They thought it was a real deal that this person was really proposing to this person. But the person had a household in the entrapment situation and the voyeur camera situation did not know this person was um, proposing to them because they didn't even know the illegal hidden foyer camera was in there. But everybody viewing through it thought it was a reality TV show. They thought it was a real deal. It was a masculine air sign that apparently did this. A masculine Gemini Libra Aquarius that did this. But I heard he did it strictly for money. He did it strictly for money. But now people are figuring this out, that it was a scam, a spam, a fraud, and that it really was an entrapment situation. And it really wasn't a reality TV show in the past. It was a scam, a spam, a fraud. But people know information on him, the Gemini Libra Aquarius masculine that did this shit, that was part of the group that behind the scenes took all the money and the what have you, what have you for the scam, spam, fraud. They were, this person was in on it with the group. That's why, because I already did it strictly for money. <laughs> Holy shit. But these people, so it could be you or somebody you're connected to, these people are about to reveal the information. One of them to a private investigator. One of them to a um, to the police. So you could be these people. I feel for a lot of you guys, you might be these people. For some, you might be this person. This person is shiesty, 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 shiesty. But this person knew it was a scam, spam, and fraud because they collaborated with the group that took all the money on the back end. And I heard this person did it strictly for money. Um, so they received some kind of money to do this. Why the hell did they receive money to do this? I, have, I mean, that doesn't even make sense. If you're legally married to somebody, or in this case, not even legally married to somebody because it was a fraudulent document to begin with because the head of household in the entrapment situation with the illegal voyeur camera in the past still to this day don't even know they're legally married because they never put themselves in the marriage. Um, they received some kind of money, I think, from this group to do it. That's so weird. That is, we live in 2022. That is so weird. That is so weird. This air sign masculine is, has received heavy chaos in their life. Very heavy chaos in their life. And they're going to continue. A significant confession in this situation is about to occur very soon. And it's going to lock people away. Okay, I heard this air sign masculine, the one that... This is the weirdest thing I think I've ever heard in my life. But I was pulling this shit in for forever. I was pulling this shit in for forever. I've been on here for two and a half years for anybody doesn't know. I pulled this shit in in like 2020 or 2021 or something. Um, it's kind of died down since, but, um, this situation has commenced. It has stopped. It has been put to an end. Um, and thank God. But this person I heard, this air sign masculine did all this shit through the illegal hidden voyeur camera and the head of household he proposed to didn't even know, don't even know they're supposed to be in a marriage because they don't even know who the hell this person is. Um, and what have you, what have you, because they've never even met, um, still have never even met to this day to know that they're in the marriage, no knowledge of the marriage. Okay. So they don't, okay. So, <clears throat> excuse me. So the head of household that was in the entrapment situation in the past, and people thought it was the reality TV show, but it really wasn't. It was an entrapment situation for money strictly this person doesn't even know who this person is to know to can so they can identify that they're in a false marriage because i can't call it a real marriage because it's not so they don't even know who they're supposed to be married to is what i'm trying to say still to this day i hope still so this person hasn't come to this person and told them they're supposed to be in a marriage with them but they're not even supposed to be in a marriage with them because they never even consented in their right mind and body because when two people get married, both of them have to consent with their right mind, sound, and body to even be in a marriage. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call. 
someone's getting a huge breakup call. I mean, I'm serious. You have to. In order to legally get married, two consenting adults have to be in the right sound, right, right sound, sound mind and body to even get married. So it wouldn't even work to begin with. So this person has this person in an illegal entrapment marriage, false ass marriage, still to this day, but hasn't even told the person that was in this illegal um, false reality show um, entrapment situation in the past to begin with that they're supposed to be married to them. I heard this air sign masculine, Gemini Libra Aquarius, has experienced huge chaos in their life and they're going to continue. And somebody in this situation is going to confess soon. Some kind of confession. I wonder if it's these people about to go to the private investigator or the police. Um, or the air sign masculine going to confess that he did this. Why? If you want to... The thing is, is... Okay. If he really wanted to be with this person in the past, he would have actually communicated with this person, not done it through the illegal hidden voyeur camera. When he, when he knew it was an illegal hidden voyeur camera because he collaborated with the group to do it for money. If he truly cared about this person, he would have directly communicated with this person, not done it through the illegal hidden voyeur camera on the reality TV show for clout, famous status. And that's just the truth. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call. Someone's getting, I'm serious, I'm serious. That is the truth. If he truly cared, he would have directly communicated with this person, probably a female, feminine energy. Not done it for clout, fame, and status. That's the first red flag. The second red flag is he's never even told this person, still to this day, that he's done this shit. Probably because he knows this person will place a lawsuit on his ass. I mean, this is we this is weird. This is weird. This is weird. <laughs> and so criminal. So criminal. I just heard uh, the song Smooth Criminal. Well, yeah. I mean, this is so weird. <laughs> but I was pulling this shit in. I was pulling it in for a hot minute. But this uh, the cycle's already completed. The fake ass reality TV show that never was a reality TV show. It was actually an entrapment situation strictly for money. It's done now. It's done now. But now this person, um, th this air sign masculine that did all this shit and participated with this weird organized crime group in the past to do all this and to cause all this chaos and all this crazy shit. I don't know. I mean, if it is a legally binding marriage contract, there must have been fraud there because I heard this person that was in the entrapment situation, probably a fem energy. And for some of you guys, it could be you. You have to plug yourself in and refit. They still didn't even know they're in the marriage. Meaning, this person lives a separate life on their own. This person lives a separate life on their own. Now, I feel in some of these situations, they might have known each other in the past, but this person definitely doesn't know they're in the marriage or supposed to be in a marriage with this person. But the thing is, is you don't, you're not supposed to be in a marriage with anybody. Yeah, both, in order to get legally married, I've been married one time, trust me, I know this. In order to get legally married, both people have to be in their sound, right mind and body to even get married. So it's not even supposed to be in a marriage with somebody because in order to get married to somebody to begin with, you have to be in your right sound mind and body. According to the marriage document, trust me, I've been married one time and I'm divorced one time. So, I mean, yikes. This is a hot mess express. But there is going to be some kind of significant confession in here in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, you plug it in, hot resonates. A fire sign brother and an air sign sister, not blood brother and sister, of the uh, person that was entrapped in the false reality TV show in the past. There's about to be good information coming out on them soon by someone in this situation. They are huge criminals. Okay, so this person. So the... Uh, head of household, probably fem energy. You, if this resonates for you, you have to plug yourself in where you fit if you do. Um, only you know your situation and story, not anybody else. So there's about to be a significant confession in here. I think by one of these people, like I said, this person still doesn't even, nobody still even come to this person and told them all the shit that's been happened. Still, to this day, 
So it's not this person. I think the confession energy is about to come from one of these people, either about to go to the private investigator or the police or the Airsign masculine knows he did this shit and collaborated with the group in the past. This is a bunch of, this is crazy. But um, apparently this person that was in the entrapment situation in the past, the head of household in the false reality TV show of the past, they have a not blood related, I heard specifically not blood related, brother and sister so their brother and sister is not blood brother and sister um significant criminal information is about to come out on these two soon it's an air sign sister and a fire sign brother but they're not blood so ancestor and genetically as an actual brother or sister to this person so call a brother or sister or they are something else um, genetically bloodline related to this person but not an actual brother or sister but they might have grown up as a brother and sister in the past to them possibly but I think these people know criminal information on the brother and sister or or the air sign masculine that did this to himself this is so weird um, knows criminal information on the air sign sister or the fire sign brother it could be an Aries Leo Sage brother. He could have Aries Leo or Sage in a Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Man, Hammer, Jupiter, or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius sister. And they could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Man, Hammer, Jupiter charts. Um, I think these people might know information on the brother and sister, and they're going to reveal it. I heard they're criminal. So they're criminal, brother and sister mix. Or the air sign masculine that's been experiencing huge chaos in his life and is going to continue because he put himself in this shit to begin with knows information on them only these people know their story not anybody else so you have to plug it in how it resonates okay this is this is crazy all right let's pull a couple cards and then i'm gonna do some reading i'm excited about the life coaching you guys i really really am just saying i'm excited about it if you guys are interested um i I'm going to take my expertise and my knowledge that I've acquired over many years in education and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, and apply it to real world, um, real world situations. Um, so it can be anything. You can view the video if you're interested. I kind of speak on, on there a little bit about it. Um, I've researched life coaching. You do not have to have a um, certification or a, um, or a licensure or anything, but there are certifications out there for it. So once I get my foot in the door and start developing some clientele, I already have many clientele on the tarot card reading spectrum, uh, many, but I want to develop my clientele on the life coaching end. The life coaching end will be no spiritual downloads. It'll just be one-on-one -on -one hashtag real talk, privacy, confidentiality, um, advice, um, help um, within my scope and my expertise and knowledge and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But I'm excited about this. If anybody's interested, okay. But it'll be very private and very confidential. And of course, um, as a professional and a good person, I will not blab it to anybody on my channel publicly or in my world. It'll be stay, it will remain, remain private and confidential, just like the readings always have. And I have developed quite a clientele base on my, my reading side. So just let everybody know, okay? Okay, we have Angel of Balance. This is about to create a lot of balance here. A lot of balance. Number 48 would be a very significant number of one's life. Number 48. This is about to create a lot of balance here. So, um, um, revealing information on the criminal, not bloodline connected, but they, I guess they grew up as brother and sister in the past. Brother and sister and some kind of confession energy and something else. Um, it's about to create a lot of balance. For some, you could have Sag in your chart or be dealing with the Sag or you are a Sag. Possibly, because this is Sag energy or not. If you are or dealing with Sag or have Sag in your chart, you could have uh, Sag in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Femme, and Hammond, Jupiter charts. But whether you do or don't have Sag, it's about to create a lot of balance, man. A lot of balance. Let's pull one more. Spare messages here, I reflected.
These people are huge hypocrites, and these people are realizing it now. Huge hypocrites, and they're about to go down. Okay, I heard these people are huge hypocrites, huge, and uh, many people are realizing this. So I think the people that viewed through the illegal voyeur camera in the past, but they didn't know it was, they were told it was a reality TV show when it really wasn't. I think these people are realizing these people, the brother-sister combo, evil brother-sister criminal combo of the head of household, that I think they conspired to help do this shit to um, you, probably them energy for some of you to be masculine possibly. Um, I, I think everybody's getting a huge wake up call here that these people are hypocrites, they're criminals. Um, uh, this person's a huge ass criminal and he conspired with them in the past and a group, which I'm sure this person, these people were in the group and he was in the group in the past for this huge scam to basically abuse and exploit a family in the past. This is some weird, sick shit, man. And it was all over money. Number 14 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 14, caring connections reversed. They did not have any caring, any empathy, any sympathy. It was strictly for money, I heard. It was strictly for money. And obviously it was, if this person still hasn't told this person to the day they've done this. Still to the day, I heard in here, spiritual download, they still haven't told them to this day they've done this. Still to this day. I'm sure the criminal, hypocritical, hypocritical supposed brother and sister hasn't told them. No one has still told them to this day. It's a femme energy. Okay, so you are a femme energy. No one has still told you to this day, ma'am. Still to this day that they've done this to you. But it has been shut down. Um, but I'm sure you've recognized. I'm sure you saw some changes out in your world on 3D and realized there was some weird shit going on. But if you didn't know, which I'm sure you do know, it's been shut down now. But I'm sure they had to shut it down for a reason. Um, it sounds like it became popular. Um, but it became very popular. But now they're in some hot water. Okay, I heard it became very popular. So the reality TV show guy shit became very popular. So you were very popular, ma'am, if you didn't know it. You don't even know your ass is being spied on. For some, I feel you intuitively knew it from weird, weird shit that happened out in you in the world. Like what happened to me. But nobody still come to you to this day and told you, hey, there was an illegal hidden camera in your house. And hey, people were spying on you thinking it was a reality TV show. Um, but now they know it's not. I mean, nobody's had a hashtag real talk with you and told you this. But I'm sure you could have figured out there was some weird shit going on, ma'am. Um, but I heard it was strictly done over money. So no empathy, no sympathy, no caring for the situation. They strictly wanted money off this shit. I'm sure he just wanted clout, fame, status, notoriety, or I don't even know why the hell he pulled himself into this shit. Um, caring connections reverse. That's no empathy, sympathy, remorse for the situation because obviously all these people wanted to do was steal. But the people, and I heard it became very popular. So we have two people, at least two, one about to go to a private investigator and one about to go to a uh, police, the police. But I heard it became very popular. So who knows how many people were viewing through that illegal hidden voyeur camera. I'm surprised if this person, um, if that, I mean, my God, having all those illegal hidden voyeur camera in your house is dangerous. That can lead to cancer. It can lead to um, uh, somebody breaking in on your house and they know where you are. I mean, it's dangerous. It's invasion of privacy and it can lead to uh, cancer. Um the fam energy is very healthy, but it has backfired in the universe, and many other people have gained cancer because of this. The free radicals. Oh, my God. Okay, so fam energy, I heard you're still very healthy. You're still very healthy. This is the third viewing on that house today. Third. You're still very healthy, ma'am. You're very healthy, and um, you don't have cancer, it sounds like. You don't have cancer, but... I heard many other people, so some of the people that viewed through the reality TV show in the past, but it really wasn't, they have ended up with cancer because of the free radicals, I'm presuming, in this damn illegal hidden voyeur camera in the past. Um, I'm surprised you didn't end up with cancer, but I heard you didn't. So you're divinely protected and you're good, thank God. I heard you're very healthy. But some people, if you didn't know this, ma'am, and this ended up happening to you, um, and you know this is your story, possibly. 
Some people that ended up viewing through the voyeur camera and they thought it was a reality TV show in the past, they ended up with cancer, which is really sad. It's very sad. And I'm sure that's probably why people are about to go to private investigators. They're about to go to the police because people are ended up ending up now with cancer. They're ending up ill now because they participated in this, but they didn't even know for a majority of them that it was illegal and criminal to begin with because these people lied to them. The group lied to them. The illegal brother, I mean, the criminal brother and sister lied to them. This Arison masculine that was in cahoots with their ass to marry somebody and don't still don't even know, the femininity don't even know she's still married to him. They all cahooted together strictly for money. But, in, but it ended up boomeranging back and giving people cancer out in the world that did view in and they thought it was a reality TV show. No empathy, sympathy, and caring strictly for money. That's sick. It's really sick. All right. We're done. I love you guys so much. I hope everybody has a wonderful day and I hope you self and namaste.